welcome to this week's Archer's Choice. You know, like we said this week, we're hunting southeastern Colorado for river bottom whitetails. And you know, one of the things we want to share with you, as we always try to do, and that's being real. Right. You know, a lot of the shows and the videos you see, you're like, you're sitting in your, in your chair going, well, how come that don't happen to me? Right, they're, they're out there for a matter of one morning and all of a sudden they shoot the deer. Boom. It doesn't happen that way. We just don't have enough time to show you usually. And proof's in the pudding because this week's show, we, to, to show you what happened is we went there in October. To Colorado, yeah. To yep. Colorado. Went in October, had some great encounters, just didn't connect. Nope. Went back in November, prime time rut. Froze our behinds off. It was minus four before wind chills. Had some encounters, but didn't connect. <laughs> Finally. Went back in December and had some wonderful Christmas presents. But the thing was... Yeah, a week before Christmas, in <laughs> fact, yeah. The thing is, is we want to share with you is, folks, it doesn't happen overnight. You take a lot of time and a lot of effort. And most of the people doing the shows is, boy, it, it takes a lot more work than, than, than you think. And we realize that we're our, we are blessed because this is our living. This is how we make our living. And we are able to go out there three times to try, to get, we're our, very to, try to get our deer. And we want to share with you some of the encounters that we had through October and November. Check this out. This week on The Archer's Choice, we're in Colorado hunting the river running whitetails. And believe us, they were running away from us for most of the season. Southeastern Colorado is one of our favorite spots to be in the fall. But little did we know, we would be there in early fall, late fall, and well, winter too. Yes, we were hunting with our great friend and buddy, Billy Dowen and the deer just didn't want to cooperate for a long, long time. Hunting here is, well, great. See what makes it so nice is when hunting the river bottoms, all the deer are funneled through small areas that allow the hunter to be in a good spot most of the time. Picture a very large tract of land with 90% of it wide open, dry country. And down along the rivers, lush feed. Good winter wheat, milo, and some corn, and a whole lot of deer. With over five miles of private river bottom to call your own, there's no reason why we shouldn't connect on these deer early. Or is there? Sometimes the cards we're dealt means we have to go back and back again, and maybe back one more time to try and play out the whole hand. And as usual, persistence pays off once again. Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Now, let's continue on with our encounters out in Colorado. Whack!
Kirschen, mit dem Now, see, now that's pretty exciting, I mean, isn't that, it? That's I mean, it, it shows, I mean, we were out there in October, we were out there in November, and we Persistence just didn't. pays off. We were hunting hard, too, and it was cold, and you know me, I don't go out when it's that oh, cold. Oh, trust me, I know. Yeah, trust me. But now we're going to go into December, where the weather really, the temperatures weren't as it cold as they were. It was nicer in December it than nicer. it actually was in November. It was, and that, so now we're going to lead into your hunt. Yeah. And you want to tell a little bit about that hay blind that well, you're sitting in? You know what was really cool is, Billy, we watched these deer, and we watched this particular buck, consistently mm -hmm. coming out with the does in the in in the winter wheat field right the thing was is there was absolutely no way to put a blind that due to the the winds were just changing it was such a weird year we actually constructed a hay blind mm -hmm. the hay helped to keep the human scent wearing our scent locks you know our spraying down with you know with our scent away sprays but that hay actually captivated the human scent more and it well yeah baby check this out Welcome back to the Archer's <laughs> Choice. Let's continue on with Ralph's hunt. <laughs> Thank you. 
we got in this blind. We, Billy and I have been in here for, Lord, I couldn't tell you how long. I think we got in a little after two. We had some does meandering out and everything else. And finally, this ten that we've been watching for the whole bloody season <laughs> finally comes and gives me an opportunity not at 35 yards but about 22 21 <sighs> my beam and passed right through him hey billy huh what a beautiful deer huh beautiful he's beautiful ralph Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. His eye guard's got little kickers. What a magnificent old mature buck. Congratulations. Yeah, baby, huh? He was a beautiful buck. Oh, that buck. was a great deer. And oh, I mean, my gosh. you we talk spent about about a month. Almost a month, a month, out month there. on that deer. Yeah. 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 Yeah, but he, he was well worth it. Oh, right? yeah. Yeah. And then, then you know what was crazy is you you were sick, so Billy yeah, yeah, ended I, up filming me. Billy was filming you, and I apologize. I wasn't there. And, and you I know. picked you a flower because you were sick. I, I appreciate thank, your thank efforts. Thank you. I appreciate it. Even though you called in sick again I the was next so, morning. I was so sick. I was at the hospital getting antibiotics. That's how sick I was. I slept <laughs> in Friday morning. Friday afternoon, you said, Vic, how you feeling? You want to try going out? And I said, yeah, let's give it a try. I don't know what's going to happen. What but a trooper. Check this out. It's December 19th. It's about 45 degrees outside, a little bit warmer than that, actually. We're set up here in Colorado. The River Bottoms Rough shot a really good buck last night. I've been sick. I actually ended up going to the emergency room just to get antibiotics, but I'm hoping I can hold my cough down long enough that the deer will come by me and give me an opportunity to shoot. We'll see what happens. Hey, welcome back. Now let's <coughs> continue on with Vicky's on. <coughs> Hi. Shot tags. <laughs> oh Lord, thank you. Let me tell you something. This trip, we know the deer that are out here in Colorado. We know it. This is our third trip back. Not everyone can do that. We know we are very fortunate and blessed that we can. And we thank that big guy up above that 
he gives us opportunities like this. This is just, I was coughing all night. I've got, you guys want to know the truth? I've got snot all over my turtleneck until Ralph gave me his hang, his, his little HS, uh, what, <laughs> the little gator that you put around your neck. This thing is so wet right now, it's gross. <laughs> Holy smokes, honey. <laughs> Here comes Billy. Okay. Beautiful time. Thank you. <coughs> Here comes Billy. Beautiful ten point. Look at this. Oh. Billy's coming right now. Come here. Look at. Look at. Mama got a deer. Huh? Look at that. Look at. What do you think? He's okay. Thank you for that good luck kiss. <laughs> Thank you, Whoa, Vic, huh? I mean, that was, that was Thank unbelievable. I mean, you. to think that all the coughing, all that coughing all sneezing, the I mean, the, the handkerchief I gave you and you gave oh. it back to me was gross. It was, it was, I told you I was sick. I mean, I, I was sick, but, but I, I give you credit. I mean, you were a trooper. You stuck it out and look at, look at the reward. Oh, he's a beautiful buck. And oh, great I mean, deer. the footage, I mean, he's in a dark field and, but it was still, Still shooting time out oh there. oh with no problem you know and that's one of the things is you have to seize the moment when you can you better believe it you better believe it now we want to thank billy for oh, having yeah. us out there again and and just and daryl and everybody and i mean everyone, everyone that, that there, helped Gayla us out and, and it was unbelievable and you know that's what it is it's about having memories and meeting new people and experiencing it and trust me we had almost a month in colorado and we had some unbelievable we times did. so remember come back next week same time same channel right here on, on the, the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice.